Imagine we're at an altitude of around 6,000 meters. Now let's take a breathtaking drop into the heart of Andalusia. We're in the south of Spain, Granada, a creative, dynamic city with an outstanding historical and artistic legacy nestling between the Mediterranean Sea and the peaks of the Sierra Nevada mountain range. Granada is also an example of modernity, a city where future and progress go hand in hand. It is also a point of reference for large-scale scientific and technological projects. The best example of this technological development and quality of life based on innovation and knowledge is without doubt the HTP, Health Technological Park, a current reality resulting from the unparalleled investments made by the Andalusian regional government and the unswerving commitment of the local university, Granada and Armilla councils, and other local entities. The Parque Tecnológico de la Salud is located in the southern part of the metropolitan area of Granada. First, let's take a bird's eye view of the huge area that forms the park's grounds. Now, let's go to the map and take a short 3D walk through the area. This 625,000 square meter area contains 24 buildings, 13 of which are currently functioning and 11 of which are still being built and these form the four main axes of this technopolis, the first park in Spain to specialize in life sciences, business development, research, healthcare, and teaching. These four central areas form the new city model and are the hallmark of the Granada Health brand and have converted Granada into a leading reference for health in the south of Europe. The first project promoted by the Health Technological Park was a business incubator known as Granada Beak. This center, managed by the Andalusian regional government, is a space dedicated to the creation and consolidation of technology-based companies specializing in health. Since then, many companies have taken the decision to establish themselves in the park thanks to its modern facilities and infrastructures, such as the underground walkway that surrounds the HTP and which is more than three kilometers long. Large companies such as Pfizer, the pharmaceutical multinational whose support allowed Henio to be created. Merck Sharp and Dome, involved in the development of the Medina Foundation and its research projects. The multinational Abbott, with its Nutrition Research Center, with the participation of young researchers in the initial phases of the organization's global strategic projects. Rovi Laboratories, with a Bemaparin production plant, developing drugs for the circulatory system. And innovative companies such as Master Diagnostica, specializing in research in the cellular and molecular diagnosis of cancer and infectious diseases the International Institute of Phlebology, leader in R&D for diseases of the venous system. Vercel, dedicated to the production of reagents for use in the diagnosis of infectious diseases. Servalens, a leading company in Spain in the manufacture and export of contact lenses. Neuron Bio, dedicated to research in Alzheimer's disease and the development of biofuels. Ibermuto Amur, offering an extensive range of clinical services, and Invis Biofarm, whose objective is research in orphan drugs used in the treatment of rare diseases. We end this block with the HTP Company Center. This includes well-established companies from the medical supply sector, consulting firms, and R&D companies for pharmacological, genetic, biotechnological, and nutritional products and services. The new University Hospital exemplifies the HTP healthcare model, and its eight floors are home to some of the most modern healthcare technology in existence. The teaching area of the Health Technological Park covers some 100,000 square meters. 
This area plays host to new medicine and health sciences faculties, as well as the General Services Building of the University of Granada. In addition, the faculties of dentistry and pharmacy will be established there, completing a university campus of about 7,000 students. In teaching, SEMAT is a center that is unique in Europe for the development and training of healthcare professionals, where the latest technologies in simulation and robotics are used. The SEMAT building is also home to the Granada 061 Provincial Emergency Service and the training line for the Andalusian Regional Government's Progress and Health Foundation. The Health Technological Park has placed Granada at the forefront of biomedical research. Through specialized prestigious research centers, initiatives are promoted to drive development in the pharmaceutical, biohealth, healthcare, and food sectors. Let's begin this visit starting in the Lopez Neira Institute, in which research on immunology and pharmacology is performed to fight diseases such as cancer. Now let's go to the Functional Food Research and Development Center. Here work is carried out in collaboration with agri-food companies to develop new foods and improve existing ones. In the Pharmaceutical and Food Development Center, headquarters of the Medina Foundation, a result of the collaboration between the MSD Laboratories, the Andalusian Regional Government, and the University of Granada, research is performed to discover new drugs for health systems. Let's continue with the Genomics and Cancer Research Center, Henio, a space in which the multinational Pfizer participates, and where research is performed in genetics and the body's response to new drugs. Now we invite you to get to know the Biomedical Research Center, home to highly qualified institutes in biotechnology, neuroscience, nutrition, and regenerative medicine, and which is also the headquarters of the Andalusian Public Health System's Biobank. In addition, the park is also home to other top-class centers, such as the Institute of Forensic Medicine, the Armia Health Institute, the Sport and Health Institute, the Bioregion Building, and the Health Technological Park Foundation. Facilitating the mobility of the thousands of workers, students, and users of the Health Technological Park has been one of the challenges addressed. Two stops on Line 1 of the new subway, the bus lines 159 and S3, 5,150 parking spaces and accesses from the Ronda Southern Highway and Highway A44 have all helped us to reach this objective, as well as a bike lane which is more than 7 kilometers in length linking the HTP with the city. The HTP is governed by a foundation in which the Andalusian government, the University of Granada, the regional government, the councils of Granada, Armilla, and Ojijares, and Caja Granada and Caja Rural de Granada are present. In addition, the Confederation of Entrepreneurs of Granada, the Chamber of Commerce, the CSIC, and La Zubia Council also collaborate with the HTP. At present, the HTP is already a tangible reality, an innovative architectonic complex without precedent. With a total investment of around 700 million euros, consolidating Granada as a city of the future and acting as a flag bearer for the Granada Health brand. A continuous effort over the last eight years, which in a very complicated context due to the economic situation, has managed to consolidate a model for sustainable growth, which has created more than 1,800 quality jobs, anticipating a more than promising future. At Parque Tecnológico de la Salud, we are aware that our journey has just begun. The future is now our present.